But um, do you guys think it's fair that Live Golfers are gaming the the system for the Ryder Cup points? I I think you just do what you have to do. Yeah. I I don't I'm I don't really have a problem with it with it any at all because like if the, I, I understand from the side point of you know well they knew what they were getting into when they made that move and obviously Ryder Cup eligibility was one of those issues that they probably felt that might not happen anymore because of going to live. Mm. But if they're given an opportunity to do it, why would you not do it? You know, yeah, what, yeah. They, they clearly still want to play in the Ryder Cup. If you get the chance to get some points, then go and get those points. Yeah. True. It may, might mean that you've got a bit of a closed shop, though, if you've got these invite-only events and it's just bring who you want. Because if you're, you know, a bit further down the rankings and you're trying to play your way into some of these events that you'll probably get more Ryder Cup points for, all of a sudden, if someone comes along and is invited, all of a sudden you're pushed out of the event and you, you can no longer play. Mm. You can no longer earn yourself a spot on the team. Yeah, no, very true. Yeah. It's, it's definitely, well, obviously we're asking the question why. Is, is, it, is it right or not? Um, it... it in a, in a, on a, kind of from like a selfish perspective as well, like not even necessarily looking for an American side, but from our side, there are some players that we would lose that are big heavy hitters in Ram in Hatton that I do want to be yeah, on the next team. Exactly. Yeah. You, you want the Ryder Cup to be as sort of, you know, as good as it can be. That's kind of what we said about the President's Cup a couple of weeks ago, that it probably wasn't as good of an event because they didn't have, have the you, know, guys. The, you know, the, some of the live guys. So any, for me, any way to get every single be the best player from each side, from the American side, from the European side, I'm all ears for, so. Yeah, no, you're right, the President's Cup was, we all knew what the result was gonna be prior because the international team had been gutted of, you know, maybe four or five of their best players. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah definitely. So it definitely. was always gonna happen. And can you imagine, like, currently a European Ryder Cup team without John Rahm, for example? Mm. Yeah. yeah. It just doesn't really make sense. Mm. You know, he's literally one of the best players in the world. One of the best European players. If he wasn't in that team, we would be weaker as a result. Yeah. So if there's a way, like I said, he can actually game the system, get these Ryder Cup points and be there on merit, mm. then great. Yeah, I think that's on the on merit part is probably the most important. As long as as long as it doesn't feel like it's a as David mentioned, sort of you're just being catered to to be able to do this kind of thing. Like mm. as long as it's something that is fine. They're doing it in a legal sense. I know there's nothing necessarily <laughs> breaking the law in anything that's happening, but you know that in terms of the golfing scape, it's legal. Mm. Um, and making sure that, like as Kieran's as well, getting all these guys that are the best players in the world on one golf course to compete in a European versus American fixture, I think, is very important. Not just for the general spectator, but just for also for the Ryder Cup. Mm. Just because. You know, not that it necessarily would happen, but I don't want to see it go a similar way that the President's Cup might go because America always is going to have a big pool of players that will be playing on the PGA Tour, which will be good golfers. And I don't want to see the European side start to slip away and maybe find that we get the next like couple of years. It's going to be a harder test. Yeah. You know, the whole point of the whole point of Ryder Cups, um, the whole point of the Ryder Cup, in a sense, is that you have the best players from the States the best players from Europe mm. and they are going head to head. Yeah. Without that, it becomes less of an event. Yeah. There's, there's no doubt about that. Yeah. So it doesn't really bother me. And it, it also, it also shows, I think generally like how much the anger and heat from the original live formation has died down. Yeah. Mm. Definitely. Definitely. You know, if this would have happened just after like live was announced and say John Rahm signed really early to live, I don't think they'd be quite the same. Oh, you know, he's, he's fine. He's just doing it to try and get mm. points. I think there'd be a lot more of a visceral reaction that if this was like two years ago. Yeah. yeah. So I think that initial heat has calmed down. Well, well, you can even see it by this week, you know, two of them playing together, you know, Jane Monaghan and, and Yassai, like, you know, they're both playing on the same course, you know, very, very chummy as well. Like it's, you know, the, surely that's a sign. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know if they've done that coincidentally, but you know what I mean? I mean, it, it would be an incredible coincidence if they weren't playing together for that reason. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, but European, yeah. European tour has literally just turned into Switzerland now. It's trying to be neutral ground, yeah. bringing everyone together. <laughs> you know, why can't we all be friends? Mm. Yeah. Come meet on our patch. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like there's, there's no conflicts here. You know, just have a nice game, have a chat. We got Billy Orschel watching over you. 
<laughs> like a paternal <laughs> grandfather. And, and was Rory there as well? Was Rory had he... played one of the days with one Jay. One I think I'm yeah. with Yasir with one day as well. Yeah. 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 Uh, it's interesting with Rory because he's actively like, he's taking a step back from all that stuff now. Mm. So maybe he was a, just a bit more of a, a calm balm this time. Yeah. Less shouting. I don't know, maybe I don't think he went up to Yasir and was like, I hate Liv. <laughs> What if, do, you do you want help, do you want help reading that book? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he would have said that. I don't know. Maybe walking between the fourth tee and the fairway, they might have had a little, oh, by the way, oh, just what? to let you know what's going on. <laughs> yes, he was like, I'm going to write a number down. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a big number. Yeah. <laughs> you let me know what you think. Yeah. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. Yeah. Could have a little chit chat. That would have been great, wouldn't it? Just I don't little, think they can go a full 18 holes without having a little, you know. A little, a little something. A little bit of something, something. Yeah. I've not heard anything of Greg Norman in ages. Where's Greg Norman gone? I know where he is. He was at the Newcastle, uh, Newcastle game. game. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they panned to, yeah. yeah, pan to him. Yeah. He was in a live, like bomber jacket sort of yeah. thing. Uh, and with a with a Newcastle United scarf. It was, yeah, it was funny. <laughs> it was very funny. Do you reckon he actually has watched much? I football? don't know. Do you reckon I, he's I a mean, football fan? Soccer. Yeah, prob- soccer, yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably. I mean, yeah. Australia has football. A different type of football. Yeah, yeah that's, that's true. Aussie rules, Aussie rules. Uh, which, the trophy, which gets presented? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We <laughs> Is it a cockerel? <laughs> no, 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 no. We, it we had it McKellen, at McKellen, the McKellen, McCullen, McCullen trophy, something yeah, like that? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, we McLean, some, McLean? We did some pub quizzes on the way, uh, right. uh, okay. on the way home last night. stay awake. Home, yeah, yeah, that was one of the questions. Oh, very good. Yeah, very good indeed. Uh, so, yeah, I have no issue with it.